I'm Alyssa and I'm here to tell you about Read Beyond the Beaten Path, which is our library program for this summer. You can participate by coming into the library or by doing everything online. You can find all the information that we're going to give you in this video on our website, which is cranstonlibrary.org or in this brochure. So the first thing that you can do this summer is keep track of your reading. You can do that by using Beanstack. Beanstack is just a website where you create an account and then you can join our Read Beyond the Beaten Path Challenge. You get to select which cabin that you want to join for the summer. Arts and Crafts Cabin, Outdoor Adventure Cabin, Sports Cabin, Haunted Cabin. Once you join a Read Beyond the Beaten Path Challenge, you enter how much time you spend reading each day. You can also use the built-in timer on the website. And the more you read, the more badges that you earn. I'm gonna turn it over to Elise to talk more about badges. Thanks, Alyssa. Greetings, Reading Scouts. Counselor Elise here to tell you all about our reading badges. How do you think you earn reading badges? That's right, by reading! So what we want you to do this summer is read as much as you can, whatever you want. Of course, you can read books using your eyes, but you can also read by listening with your ears. If someone reads to you or you listen to a book um, in the car, on a road trip, all of that counts as reading and you're going to want to log all of the hours that you read into Beanstack, which is our online reading log, which will let you know how much you've read and how many badges you earn. You earn one badge for every hour of reading that you do up to 20 hours. But Counselor Elise, I hear you ask, what if I want to read for more than 20 hours? That's awesome. You get one additional badge for every 10 hours you read after that first 20. So you read for 30 hours, you get a badge. Read for 40 hours, you get a badge. Read 50 hours, guess what? Yeah, you get a badge. What kinds of things should you read? Absolutely anything. It could be a book, it could be a magazine, it could be a gaming guide, it could be the back of a cereal box. As long as you read, as long as your brain intakes the information, it totally counts for reading and you can earn badges. Just remember to log them. But Counselor Release, I can hear some of you ask, what if I read for more than 50 hours? That's amazing. Just make sure that if you read for more than 50 hours, you take time to sleep and also to drink water because hydration is important. But again, Counselor Release, I can hear some of you say, what if I don't have time to do all that reading this summer? Is there another way that I can earn badges? Yes, there is, Scouts, and I'm going to hand you over to Counselor Martha and Counselor Taylor, and they'll tell you all about different ways to earn badges and what happens with the badges that you earn. Spoiler alert, there might be prizes in your future. But go on, read on, have a great summer. We hope to see you at the library, Scouts. Thanks, Counselor Elise. So why would you want to earn badges? Because it'll feel really good to do a great job but you can also win prizes, and that's really exciting. Do you remember the cabins that Counselor Alyssa was telling you about? Well, for each cabin, there are a few prizes that you could win through a raffle. You can win a pottery wheel from the Arts and Crafts cabin, or an archery kit from the Outdoor Adventure cabin, or a remote control tarantula. We will draw the winners of the prizes at the end of the summer and contact you if you've won. Well, now that you're excited about prizes, you're gonna wanna learn about more ways to earn badges and Counselor Taylor is gonna tell you all about it. Oh, hey everyone. I'm Counselor Taylor. This summer on top of reading badges and fun prizes, we'll also have Read Beyond the Beaten Path kits available to pick up at any Cranston Library location. The first kits will be available to pick up starting June 28th. Each kit will have a cool book-related theme like mystery, fantasy, graphic novels, history, nature, and science fiction. Each kit has all the materials you need for three fun activities. Three whole activities! That's like two activities with a bonus activity. And once you've completed your kit, you'll get a secret code inside. Ooh, secret code. Enter the secret code into Beanstack and then you'll earn a badge for that week. 
Now let's check back in with Counselor Alyssa to hear about button badges. Thanks so much, Elise, Taylor, and Martha. So now you know all about Read Beyond the Beaten Path. You know that you can log your reading on Beanstack to earn badges and raffle tickets. Check. You know that you can request kits filled with fun items, and you know that each kit has a secret code that you can enter into Beanstack to get a Read Beyond the Beaten Path badge. Check. There's one more thing that you need to know. Once you earn a Read Beyond the Beaten Path badge in Beanstack, you can actually come to the library and get a real button badge. There's a link in Beanstack that you click to request one of these button badges. So I hope that you have fun reading Beyond the Beaten Path this summer, and I hope that you'll come visit us at the library. Peace out, Reading Scout.